Hi there. So my daughter, as some of you may have known, I posted that she was asking about um, having sushi for lunch because a friend of hers had some sushi and so she um, wanted some, but it had like sausage in it and rice and so she wasn't quite sure, um, you know, how to make it. So I did some asking on Facebook, I did some research, and so I kind of found a way. So I already made one roll, so I already tested it out, so I know it works. So I'm gonna move the phone a little bit so you won't be able to see my face necessarily, but you'll be able to see um, what I'm doing here on the mat. So we bought our sushi, we um, just bought Stash Makes Sushi, so this, or the, this is not the sushi, the nori, so this is what we bought. So you put it um, down, it says the rough rough side up. So we're gonna put a sheet sheet on here with the rougher rougher side up. And then, so I'm gonna dampen, dampen my fingers, it says, and get the rice. So we're using brown rice. I cooked it in, um, I cooked the brown rice in the summer. That's how I always cook my rice. We don't get minute rice. We always get rice and then cook it, cook it in the steamer. So this is the brown rice. So you, um, and then I mixed it with some rice vinegar um, to, because that's what the direction said. I don't know if that makes it stickier or what exactly that does, but I did it because the directions say. I cook because sometimes because the directions say to do it and I don't always know why. So, <laughs> so I'm patting, patting the rice on here, um, leaving about an inch to half an inch at the top. I've read a couple different directions as far as what to leave um, on the top as far as the space so and I had a bamboo mat years ago I must have gone on like this you know binge of wanting to learn to make sushi or something and my husband made um, bought me like a sushi making kit and it's never been used before so here we go perfect opportunity to use it I can't believe I didn't get rid of it in all of our moves I must have had some vision that someday I would um, learn to use it. So here we are patting, patting the rice. So I've got the rice on here. Um, so I'm going to step over here really quick and wash, wash the rice with my hands. Okay, so what we're doing is we got um, some chicken sausage, actually pineapple chicken sausage. So we already cooked the sausages earlier today. And so I cut them into um, long strips so that they can fit here. So we're putting sausage on here. The first one I did didn't have quite as much sausage in it, so I'm trying to get more sausage in it to make it for a good um, school lunch. So then we did some red pepper strips. We've got the red pepper strips that we're gonna put in. Put them in here. This is a lot easier than I expected it to be. And then my daughter likes avocado, so I got some avocado cut up here into strips. And then what I did is I cut it up and then um, took half a lime and just squeezed a bunch of lime juice to um, to get it so hopefully the avocado doesn't turn brown. I kept asking her all these questions about her friend's sushi and if the um, if it was brown or not and uh, she said no so I'm guessing she used lime juice so um, we'll see. And then so the directions I found had um, using bean sprouts and so I'm putting some bean sprouts in. My daughter's never really eaten bean sprouts before. But I figured um, we'd just put them in anyway and it would make it good. So, so then, so I've got it on the bamboo mat. So what I did was I bring the bamboo mat up as I, to help roll it, to get it all the way around and get it good. So I'm gonna get it rolled good and tight. Okay, I'm losing some avocado out here. Let's see if I can shove it back in. <laughs> We'll see. Okay, so getting this good and tight. So then you take um, some water. So I just kept like a little thing of water sitting here and you wet wet the edge, wet the edge of it so that it sticks and then wrap it back up in the bamboo, in the bamboo sheet and it um, to get it kind of good and tight. So you want to kind of press a little bit to tighten it all up together as I roll it up. So I'm kind of pressing as I roll it back up in the bamboo sheet. And so then I'm just going to kind of press together. I do have a little um, avocado sticking out the end there. 
um, but kind of press it together. And it says to leave it sitting for um, a minute, a few minutes before cutting it um, into servings. And so I just used this my serrated knife to cut it. Uh, but I did notice the sheets that we bought, nori sheets we bought, have some serration on there. So it probably makes it a little bit easier um, to be able to to do it, to cut it. But I just used the knife and it cut really easily. Um, so then we'll use a whole roll, a whole sushi roll cut up for our daughter's lunch. So I'm going to unroll it and then leave it just kind of sitting for a couple minutes before I cut it. Um, but here you go. It's all rolled up. Again, I have a little avocado sticking out the side there. Um, but I'm just going to leave it for a minute while I wait before I cut it um, and get it off of the mat, mat so I can cut it on the cutting board. I'm really excited that I figured out how to do this. It's supposed to help me do it. And then, of course, the neighbor kids showed up at the front door. And so we let her go play for a couple minutes, which it's probably going a lot quicker anyway for me to <laughs> do this. Um, I'm glad that you think it looks good already, Shane. Great. Um, I think, you know, I, it looks so good when I started cutting the other one that I think I might try to figure out doing this for myself for lunches too. Because now that I know how to do it, it's you can put so many other things in there, like even like shrimp and avocado and vegetables, just all vegetables and cucumbers. My daughter's not a big cucumber fan. Otherwise, we would have. Um, I would have probably cut up some cucumbers, you know, carrot sticks, whatever. So I'm gonna go ahead and start cutting, cutting these ones. Okay. There we go. So I'm cutting them just about that big, as you can see there. So I'll pick one up here and show it to you. I'll cut. Um, so there you go, you have the sushi roll, you got all the goods in the inside, it's all sticking together. And um, so I made, I'm going to do two days, two days, two lunches worth to um, for now. So we have a couple of days of lunch already ready for her during the week. So that's it, sushi, good sushi with pineapple chicken for kids. Um, so I'll let you know if she likes when she eats them for lunch tomorrow. Thanks, bye.